On Fox Business Thursday morning, contributor Joe Concha complained about the homeless problem in New York City, connecting it to the smell of weed in Central Park. He also berated Mayor Eric Adams for lack of progress on crime rates and surging homeless populations. Let's take a look. Yet we're allowing these people out onto the streets, and we wonder why there's an exodus going out of New York and out of San Francisco and Los Angeles. It is primarily due to crime. It's due to the drug use that we see in the open air. I took a walk up to Central Park yesterday, had mm -hmm. some time to kill. I could not escape the smell of weed everywhere. And it's just, New York is not what it used to be. I know that personally. You go through Penn Station when you take a train into this city, and you're walking over bodies that you don't know are alive or dead. The homeless are everywhere. And and, and this, this mayor can talk a big game, start to do something about it, sir, because you're going to lose all that tax revenue as people move more and more to places like Florida, to Kentucky, to Idaho. In recent years, homelessness in New York City has reached the highest level since the Great Depression of the 1930s. To combat the issue, New York City Mayor Eric Adams and the Partnership for New York City recently announced the launch of the Homeless Assistance Fund. The funding will provide services and mental health resources from both nonprofit and the private sector to unhoused New Yorkers. This program aims to strengthen the city's existing homeless outreach initiatives, including the mayor's subway safety plan that has connected approximately 2,000 individuals to shelter access since beginning in February. In a statement from Mayor Adams following the announcement of the new funding, he said, When New Yorkers come together to do the right thing, we can make real progress. The Homeless Assistance Fund is a public-private partnership that will continue our work to tackle street homelessness by bringing together more than 60 of New York City's businesses to offer support, resources, and a path to stability for people experiencing homelessness. With respect to the Fox News pundit's criticism over the smell of weed, as of March 2021, it's been legal for adults 21 and older to possess up to 3 ounces of cannabis and up to 24 grams of concentrated cannabis for personal use in New York. Adults may smoke or vape cannabis wherever smoking tobacco is allowed under the smoke-free air laws. He may want to consider moving elsewhere if this is a deal-breaker for him. According to the Coalition for the Homeless, the nation's oldest advocacy for unhoused individuals and families, research shows that the primary cause of homelessness, particularly among families, is lack of affordable housing, not drug use. With the implementation of the mayor's homeless assistance fund and his subway safety plan, hopefully New York City will soon see a decrease in its constituents experiencing homelessness. Thank you for watching Raw Story TV. Please be sure to visit us at rawstory.com. Stay informed and tap below to take action by liking, subscribing, and joining all those who like their news raw.